So this is a Victorian era tricycle. It's made of hickory, likely manufactured in about 1876. An implement store owner at Mount Tabor brought it home for his children around that time. Eventually, a man named Richard Gray found it in a barn in the Portland area and uh, gave it to his mother. And she kept it for her grandchildren, and this was in the 40s and 50s. They rode it around the neighborhood and in parades and stuff, and there was an article about it in the Oregonian because everybody had seen them riding around the neighborhood on this weird contraption. After they grew out of it, she wrote a letter to a professional clown named Emmett Kelly for use in his circus act, but he turned it down because he said there was no room in the caravans. It's a high wheeler like a lot of tricycles and bicycles were at the time. It was um, built before bicycles were really standardized, so they didn't have chains, they didn't move the way bicycles do now. Um, and instead of pedals, this one has these stirrups that you would put your feet in. And in order to make it go forward, you would push on these stirrups and they would make the saddle go forward and backward, which would um, turn the shaft between the back wheels and then it would propel the tricycle forward. And it wasn't a very fast or dignified way to move, so uh, it didn't ever catch on. And there really aren't many models left that I can find. It's a pretty special artifact. Be sure to put in the part with me running into the pallet.